no matter how tough you are, getting diagnosed with cancer is terrifying, stressful, and often comes with a huge financial burden. Our Kelly Kennedy happens to know exactly how it feels. She was diagnosed with cancer five years ago. Well, today she introduces us to the Hope Lodge in Cleveland. I do know how terrifying it is to hear those three words. You have cancer. It's a punch in the gut and it feels like your whole world has been turned upside down. It's hard to know what to do next. But there is a place right here in Cleveland that can make the fight against cancer a little bit easier. Debbie Polson never imagined she'd spend the summer of 2023 staying at the American Cancer Society's Hope Lodge in Cleveland. Certain things that used to bother me, the little things before, just seem like noise to me now. Polson lives in St. Louis. In February, she went to the doctor for an infection in her finger that she couldn't get rid of. Shortly after that, she was diagnosed with AML leukemia. Do you remember how you felt in those moments when you first got the news from your doctor? You know, it was a huge shock. It, I've sort of described it as, you know, maybe being, you know, someone hijacking my life. You know, suddenly, all of a sudden, it's everything has changed, but just temporarily. I managed to hold it together pretty much during the call, but it broke down after. After doing some research, she decided she wanted to get treatment at the Cleveland Clinic. And then she heard about the Hope Lodge. It allows you to get the care that you want at the medical facility of your choice and not having to worry about, you know, the cost of lodging. The Hope Lodge is a place where people getting cancer treatment as well as one of their caregivers can stay for free. They just need to live at least 40 miles away and be over 18. The Cleveland Hope Lodge saved guests $1.2 million last year. But Polson said the Hope Lodge has helped her with more than just saving money. You're surrounded by all of these other patients and caregivers and survivors that are facing the same challenges that, that you are. And so what may seem at times to be a very lonely journey is not so lonely anymore. Polson has been fighting an uphill battle against leukemia. She was hoping chemo and radiation would cure her, but her doctors told her she needed a bone marrow transplant. After they couldn't find a match, her son volunteered. You know, I felt bad all the, the treatment he had to go through, you know, the, the testing and everything prior to that, but he's like, come on, mom. Don't be ridiculous. The Cleveland Hope Lodge really is the only place like this in our area, so unfortunately, there is a wait list. But the good news is that they're expanding. They broke ground on a construction project in June, and they're hoping to wrap it up by the fall of 2024. The expansion will take the Hope Lodge from 31 rooms to 43. They're adding 12 suites for guests staying for longer times, as well as more laundry facilities, another living area, and a meditation studio. In Cleveland, Kelly Kennedy, 19 News. Well, on Saturday, the American Cancer Society's Hope Lodge will have its biggest fundraiser, the Discovery Ball at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, and our Kelly Kennedy will be the MC. So if you'd like to donate to the Hope Lodge, we'll have a link on our website, cleveland19.com.